Wow, that sounded horrible. What's good, you guys? It's your boy, Jay Ruff, back at it again with more Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Classic Mode. In the last episode, we played World of Light. We played as Sephiroth for one match. And then we heavily enjoyed playing as Pyra and Mithra. And we made it closer to another dungeon. In this episode, we are finishing out the last of the Nintendo 64 original Smash Brothers characters. And a Dark Samus. I know I keep saying we play, we're play, we playing as all the original N64 characters, but Dark Samus is up there. Not technically an N64 Smash character, even though she is an Echo Fighter of Samus, but nonetheless, that's why this is the 13th one, not the 12th one. But we are playing as Jigglypuff. I can, as, I, as you can see, I had a terrible run originally as this. Um... But in any case, that that means we can only get better, right? Uh, that looks like a Pokemon hat. So why don't we go with that? Since I already have the the Nurse Joy hat, that's kind of the one. And we've seen a Sleepy Jigglypuff already. Let's let's do that one. But this one, I didn't even break a million. So expectations very low. We do have a classic ticket. Let's try and do better here. So I'm assuming. The gimmick with this would be the original Smash 64. Yeah, it looks like it. The original Smash 64 uh, classic mode. Which always started out against Link at Hyrule Castle. Right, we're gonna have a match against the Mario Brothers, a giant Donkey Kong, the works. This is a Pokemon hat. Okay, cool. Can I get a rest? Oh, fuck. I was close. I'm not great with Jigglypuff, so I'm not even gonna... Even though Jigglypuff can be good. Like, you're not doing any of your cra crazy attacks. I was gonna be really happy if we got caught in that. Oh, come on. Alright, now rest. Son of a bitch, hit a rest! Oh, he shielded that one. There we go! That might be the first rest I've hit in, uh... No, I definitely have hit a rest in this playthrough, in the Smash Brothers in general. I just barely got a missed a nice there. That probably would have been a nice had I not taken so much damage. No? Alright, I guess it isn't. But it is trying to do the Smash 64 thing. What the fuck, Mario? You're only a little bit better, right? Better than Link. Like, you're literally just 5'5". Five, five. Not, not in size. It's probably a little taller than that. That was in tune with the music. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Yes, do that right next to that bomb. Huh? 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 Mario? Huh? Oh shit! <gasps> oh, that should put him to sleep. Alright, this is a Rage Blaster, so... Oh my god, I could die at any second. This is... I don't like Jigglypuff! Fuck. I might get, like, three from that one. Four, alright. Next time I'll get three. Samus and Yoshi. Alright, what, what? Also, this stage is great. It's bigger than I remember it. I like it's got the original music tracks too. Holy fuck. I'm getting my ass kicked. Go to sleep, bitch. Alright. Ooh, Death Scythe. Yes. The items are gonna be really helpful here. Get down here. Jigglypuff, put it down! Listen to my songs, bitch! What the? Samus. What? Game. What the fuck? <laughs> Can I get a nice- I should get a nice play for that. Yay! Seven. Six point six. Kirby and Fox. Ready? We're just coupling them all together. Whatever. Bam! Falcon punch! 
Like, they should have really been as close to the original Smash Brothers uh, classic mode as possible. But, alas, they didn't. Hey, look, another bomb. How about this? Boom. Can I get another rest? Alright, I'm setting it up for it. I'm setting it up. Or I could just do the old Jigglypuff off the... Oh, I wanted to see what the assist trophy was. Alright, well, that's another... That's another nice play. Eight, okay. Hey, we're already better than our last one. And this is for Pikachu, okay. I don't know why Pikachu gets to be on as lonesome. I mean, I'm assuming we're gonna be facing a giant Donkey Kong, right? Also, this would only make sense if we're playing against just solely Master Hand. Alright, well, thankfully the Pokemon matchup, Electric is not super- Oh, oh no, 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 no! Oh, fuck. He's fine! He's fine in that black hole. Oh, that was cool. Oh, well. Rest! Yes! Oh, God! I would have died there if I didn't get that. Holy shit. That was a nice... That was the nicest play I've ever done. <laughs> we got one more battle, right? Oh, yeah, that's just... What? This has to be a free-for-all, right? Nope, it's not a free-for-all. Is this supposed to be the fighting polygon team? Fuck me. They just casually... You still haven't faced... Oh, so let me guess. The giant DK is the, the boss here? Because sometimes it, does, it, isn't, it doesn't have to be a boss character. It could be just a giant, you know, character. I don't like that, that bomb is there! Alright, alright, I like that. Sleepy Puff. Oh, hell yeah. What is happening? Fuck you, Luigi! Wow, um... What's happening here? Interesting. Interesting. I'm not... It, I'm just saying it's interesting. Also, this looks... Now it, this... Oh, no. It's a, it's a small hat. Alright. Let's go. Jigglypuff. Being jiggly tough. Alright. Oh, I skipped things. I don't know if that makes the... I don't know if the black hole has, like, rubber band AI. I don't think so. Alright, let's go... Yeah. I can make that. I can make that. I did. Well done, Jigglypuff. I do like Jigglypuff's floatiness. Uh, they feel... Like, more floaty than Kirby, to be honest. Even though Jigglypuff has no basis for doing that floating jump. In like the, you know, any Pokemon game. What's goody guys, it's JRuff and I hope you're enjoying this video. Remember that you can become a member of this channel for only $1.99 a month. That's under $24 for an entire year. As a member, you'll get access to exclusive content like my brand new Let's Play of Luigi's Mansion for 3DS. But wait, because if you become a member, there's even more. Like my complete Let's Play of Sonic Origins featuring Tails and everyone's favorite echidna, Knuckles. You'll also get access to my one year of GM mode in SmackDown vs. Raw 2006 and Godzilla Save the Earth exclusive action mode mode runs. That's not even mentioning the cool badges and member exclusive emotes you'll get to use in chat, plus so much more to come. And if you want to help out the channel without becoming a member, please like this video, subscribe, and hit the bell as well to stay updated on more new content from me, JRuff. Also, make sure to catch my streams every Wednesday, but keep an eye out because streams can happen other days as well. Thanks again for watching, and let's get back to the show. Alright, it's Giant DK, isn't it? Yep. Is the giant DK that you face here? Oh! Oh! That could have been very bad. You know, usually you had a team of three for this. Oh, come on. He's having a hard time hitting me. Okay, come on. 
Ah, uh, come on. I'm not, I don't know if I should try a rest here. Oh, God! That could have been it. Oh, my God, I'm so scared. Oh, oh! Um. Um. Uh. How'd I do? Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! 9.9! With Jigglypuff! What? What? 9.9 .9 with Jigglypuff! <laughs> <coughs> oh god! Oh god! What the fuck? I'm speechless. We got a 9.9 .9 with Jigglypuff. I wasn't sure if I would get a 9.9 .9 in this playthrough. Let alone with fucking Jigglypuff, who I originally got a 7.2 with. I, like, I, you know what, it's, I just always have to set my expectations, though. These. I just always have to. I literally said at the end of the Captain Falcon one, I'm gonna set my expectations low. Because when do I fucking play as Jigglypuff? And granted, it wasn't a real boss. It was a giant Donkey Kong. Like, it's not like how Giga Bowser... Because Giga Bowser doesn't take... Like, Giga Bowser is just super armor because it's a boss. Donkey Kong flinches when you hit it. So it's a little bit different. But... Holy hell, I didn't die once. I think I perfectly paced that. Like, I didn't I didn't get too many nice plays when it was inconvenient. I played smart, I played, you know, moving around and shit. I hit vital points when I needed to. That is easily the best that we've had so far. Kick the crap out of Ness. Kick the crap out of all oh, Captain Falcon, man! Captain Jigglypuff. Holy I don't even I don't know what I'm gonna title this. I don't know what what I'm gonna how what Jigglypuff 9.9. .9. You know how long it took for me to like alright, when I first was playing classic mode, I was like like, Bowser was the first character who was like, I need to get a 9.9 .9 with Bowser. I played multiple runs of his classic mode in order to get 9.9 .9 because I was like, I need to have a 9.9 .9 with Bowser. I just need to. For, for my pride. I... Granted, I've played this before. But I got a 7.2. Also, I did just get all of the credits again. So I'm getting better at this. Holy shit. This could be my best run overall in classic mode. We're gonna have to see. That was fun. Where I would rank it? I'd put it pretty high. I don't know where, because we're getting kind of long now. I wouldn't put it at number one. But just, you know, having one of the characters... Because, like, what are you gonna do for fucking Jigglypuff, honestly? But for having one of the characters, like... Oh, I guess I missed one, because it's 129. It wouldn't it have been 30? Well, I didn't destroy all of the other things there. The Pegasus Sisters. Malin. Melon. Starlo. But yeah, having Jigglypuff stand in. Uh. Well, that kicked the crap out of my original Jigglypuff score. I don't think that's the highest score, though. No, just a little bit under. But wow, just. 9.9 .9 with Jigglypuff. The fact that that's even a thing. 
the fact that that's even a thing. Look at this. All of the top row. All of them. None 9.9. .9. These three 9.8. But that probably had to do with a lot of classic tickets that I was just burning without realizing that I should probably save them. But holy... To round out the all 60, original all 64, we got 9.9. .9. I didn't die. I wasn't really even close to death. With... I, I'm, I'm just gonna... Jigglypuff, man. Fuck. I don't know that I'll have a better performance in this entire playthrough. But we've got... What? 60 characters left to go? So, with that, that is it for this episode of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Classic Mode. In the next episode, we go back to the forest in World of Light, and then we're starting the melee cast next in Classic Mode with Peach, who I actually did pretty well with, I guess. We'll see what happens next time. Gee, I wonder who her final boss is going to be. Thank you guys again. I need I need a drink. That was wild. See you guys in the next one. Jiggly peace. Actually, actually, I didn't say it. Oh, I'm I'm very slow. Where's Gina? Is he appear afterwards? Also, why does Bowser have purple hair? I think that was part of that part of Mario's Ice Mario. It's interesting. I don't know why that's the case. Like, Ma like Kirby is Mallow, that makes sense. Oh, that was epic. I don't know why it's so epic. Who's saying that? Oh, 